Aloha my kako and welcome to my channel. So today I'm going to be unbagging this. I uh, placed an order for like four, I think I just bought four um, lip products from the Lip Bar which is a black owned makeup brand. The founder of the Lip Bar, her name is Melissa Butler and she created it specifically for uh, women of color, black women specifically, to have bold lips because um, a lot of the time um, people with darker skin tones don't feel comfortable wearing uh, bold lip colors, bright lip colors. So that's what her brand is all about, making sure that um, women and women of color, black women specifically, feel more comfortable in their skin while wearing very bold lip products. And so, of course, I decided to support because that's an amazing thing to do. I'm going to open this up and this is going to be a first impressions and I'm going to have lip swatches for all of them. Let me get some logistics for y'all. So, Last week, Saturday, was Tropical Storm Derby Day. Um, so I bought a lot of stuff. So that was just one week ago, and I got this package, I think, on Thursday? Okay, so I ordered it on Saturday, it shipped on Sunday, and I got it either Wednesday or Thursday. And let me tell you, being in Hawaii, that shit don't happen a lot. Especially with um, makeup stuff well in my experience so that was awesome it, the shipping was fast and it was easy it's all good okay so let's see if the products are actually good so first it comes in in this cute little package that has the brand name cute and it comes packaged like this and it comes with a little uh, note. Vegan Beauty, the lip bar. In a world where everyone is trying to look the same, the lip bar exists to challenge the standard of beauty. I began producing natural and vegan lipsticks in my kitchen in 2012 with the idea that you shouldn't compromise your health for beauty. So I used my personal favorite ingredients like shea butter, avocado oil, and vitamin E to create a non-toxic beauty brand for all complexions. I believe in high quality, low cost beauty. I believe in using nature's best ingredients. I believe in guilt-free good look, look, looks. I believe in guilt-free good looks. I believe there is beauty in everyone. Melissa, founder and CEO. I'm not rich or nothing. And these weren't like $5 lip products. So I didn't buy like a lot. Because I also bought, you know, other stuff from other places. So actually I did buy more products and I will be showing that in a video. Like, similar to this one, I guess. Like, first impressions. First? First? Okay, so, um, the first one I'm looking at is the matte gloss. I bought a matte gloss. This is liquid matte in the shade... I don't know. Maybe, maybe it's on the thing. Hold on. So, this is what the product looks like. Super cute. Super, super cute. So, this is in the shade Boy Trouble and it is a um, bright orangey red look. This is the kind of colors I like. So this is what the swatch on my hand looks like. It's definitely a very bold red, reddish orange color. But the packaging seems really sturdy, so I like that a lot. I don't know how to stand this up because I kind of like showing my you know, whatever piece of crap makeup station I have back there. I kind of like showing these off and just like putting it side by side. So it can't stand on its own, obviously. So that's just, that's kind of junk, but that's all right. The next color is also a liquid matte. And this one is in the color Silent Killer. So this color is more pale navy blue. It's so awesome. It's like a grayish blue. It reminds me of paint. I don't know. It just reminds me of like this awesome paint that I like to use sometimes. Paint. Paint colors, you know. I'm fine. Um, the next one is a lipstick. The packaging is really so awesome. I don't have packaging um, like this at all in any of my makeup products, so that's pretty cool. 
Oh, that's cute. It has like a little um, lip sticker here and it's got the brand name here, the lip bar. This one is a metallic gold and I know metallics are really in right now so I thought I'd try it out. Oh, this is shiny. But the metallic uh, lip color is called Everything. And the last one is also a lipstick. This brown is from their Signature Cocktails line. And it's, it's like, I guess it's just like a normal lipstick. And this one is in the shade Coco Cooler. So this is like a, um, a reddish brown. A very warm, warm brown. I'm gonna start off with the application with the metallic. It's very creamy. It's very soft on the lip. Ooh! Oh shit! 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 I love it! Oh damn! So I, I love how it kind of looks like um, tangerine orange, like in a certain light. I think it's because um, my natural lip color um, is, is pigmented. It's a little bit... Um, brownish pink my natural lip color and having this on top makes it look a little orangey so i'm into that this would look good too um underneath like a, a neutral brown lip pencil that'd be nice next one i'm going to try is coco cooler I bought this one um, because the other three were kind of really bold looks and this one is kind of an everyday sort of natural look, um, especially for me. Pinkish browns are my favorite um, to wear um, anywhere, everywhere, because it's kind of close to my natural lip color, um, especially to work. Uh, so I, I bought this one because uh, I just, I, I need them all. I gotta catch them all. Those two formulas were amazing. They're so soft. They're so creamy. I, I really exfoliated my lips this morning because I knew I was going to do a lip video and it just feels amazing. Um, so really, really, like anytime you wear lip product, just really exfoliate your lips and it'll make your experience so much better. I think the next one I'm going to do is uh, Boy Trouble and this is the liquid matte. I'm kind of scared. My lips always get a little bit dry, so kind of like to I dab my lips with um, a little bit of lip balm. You just never know. I don't know if it works or not, but I just do it. Listen, this is one coat and it is so bold. It is out there. It is, you can see it from a goddamn black hole a billion light years away, man. There's nothing on there. This is amazing, okay? But this is first impressions, okay? I could completely change my mind after I wear it outside. I do stuff with it. I eat, I drink, I do whatever else, okay? But the color is amazing. Oh. Well, what's good about it is I can't take it off with this because it, it stays on, which is good. Bad for me because I'm lazy. Now I gotta get my coconut oil. And last but not least, Silent Killer. This is my first um, blue, I think.
again, this is one coat. And so that was my first impressions and um, my swatches. I think I'm just going to intertwine them all. I don't know. Like my first impressions were really the, these are amazing, amazing products. The lipsticks are creamy and amazing and I don't even know what else to say. It's just really, really good. The metallic one is awesome and this one is great for every day, the, the cocoa cooler and these are amazing these are beautiful vibrant and and just unique i love them the reason i bought from lip bar is because i've been meaning to buy um from a black owned makeup brand i was gonna buy from colored rain but then i saw that uh bullshit instagram post about them being all like all lives matter shit and it's like uh, no duh, all lives matter, and that's why we're focusing on the lives that are getting hurt, okay? So I was not down with that, even though it is a black-owned makeup brand and it has amazing colors, I think the lip bar is a great alternative. Just by talking right now and using their liquid matte, it, it's amazing. It's a... It's awesome. Like, I feel so edgy. I'm definitely, definitely recommending them and please, if you can, um, spend your money on black-owned makeup brands or, you know, just small businesses who support people of color, especially, um, you know, in the beauty industry where it's very Eurocentric. I'll list them down below and also I'll have the, um, the lip bar um, website down below as well so you can just get on down to it. Tell me what you guys think if you have these, if you're thinking of buying these, please, please let me know. Mahalo Nui Loa as always for watching. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you're not already. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in a later one. Shoots. Hold up, I gotta catch the side look. Never be like you. Oh, mess. Mess.